So what do you do if you've got LVT in your building and it's dirty already? You'll want to approach it with two steps. First, approach it with something to restore the appearance and the brilliance of your LVT. And that's really where the doodle scrub and the pivot, along with our 3D blue tile and grout pad, come into play. The doodle scrub and the pivot do a great job of providing orbital action to the 3D blue tile and grout pad. Now, don't let the name fool you. Even though it's called a 3D blue tile and grout pad, it's really for any surface that's three-dimensional. And when you think about it, LVT with the grooves in the flooring is a three-dimensional surface. Now, the beauty of the 3D blue tile and grout pad is it does a great job of digging deep into those texture marks and those grooves in the LVT and gently digging everything out. It's not abrasive. And one of the things we tell people is that the first time you clean your LVT flooring with the 3D blue tile and grout pad, just use water. The reason we say just use water is that you're going to reactivate detergent residue that's down in those texture marks and you're going to see foam anyways. So the first couple times you really won't need to clean with any detergent. Now what I want to do is I want to show you a video of this in action. Now I'm going to let the video play and what I want you to pay attention to is the fact that as soon as we put water down on this floor uh, and start to scrub it with the doodle scrub, and the 3D blue tile and grout pad, you're gonna notice that the floor turns muddy and you're gonna notice that it starts to foam. And that's just reactivating all the detergent residue that's already in that floor. But what I really want you to pay attention to is what the floor looks like when it's finished. Let's take a look at this video and watch the doodle scrub in action with the 3D blue tile and grout pad on LVT flooring. So what you saw was the 3D blue tile and grout pad cleaning that LVT flooring. And that appearance is amazing because when that video starts, you think, ah, it's just a dark wood LVT floor. But when you finish, you realize that's actually a lighter wood floor and the dark appearance was really just all the soil and detergent residue that had built up on that floor. Now, important to remember, even though you saw the doodle scrub in a 3D blue tile and grout pad in that video, the doodle scrub actually has the same downforce as the pivot. So if you were to take a 3D blue tile and grout pad and put it on a pivot for bigger LVT areas, you'll get the same results. Next, let's look at what do you do once you get your floor cleaned to maintain it and make sure that you don't get back to that dirty looking floor again.